Hello everybody, welcome to Impressive Image Maker channel. This is Toshi Yagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. Um, this is my subject today. I shot this image for a long time ago. Well, I have this image by 120 film reversal. And I have this image and also I made this pencil drawing type image by Adobe Photoshop used filter called Find Edges. I'm going to use these two images to get something creative image as always. Well, I'm gonna um, try to make some kind of oil painting like. Well, let's try it. Okay, let's get started. I'm gonna make duplicate layer from this base image. And I'm going to just keep this base image, turn it off to keep it down now. Then I'm going to smudge on this image. Now, um, I'm going to use my tool, this Evolve, which is I really like. Okay, that's uh, about 70%, for small size. Uh, this is a shot on Arizona. Well, go to the east from LA. Mm, maybe I don't. I'm mean, not quite remember. Three or four hours probably. Then one of the desert area. So it's dry ground like this. So I don't know how it's going to turn out. Well, anyway, I'm going to try to make something, something new, something exciting, exciting. Let me try. Well, anyways, I'm going to uh, smudge all the way model's body, body and the ground, this dried image too. Just the one umbrella lighting you can see on her eyes. I'm going to smudge to outside. Well, make it big size. Now I'm going to smudge her hair and the face. Well, almost done for smudging. Okay, let's see. Some touch up. I will see this uh, pencil drawing type image. Turn on. 
Then let's see, change the blend mode. Darken, multiply, color burn, linear burn. Well, not much difference. Let's see. What I want, what I think interesting is about around here, like you see the pencil drawing type of image. And I think her hair is nice to have this texture and details. I want to make this detail of her hair and uh, and also, I want to do, uh, make difference on this, what do you call it? this dried ground, sort of uh, cracking on the ground because of the dried. That texture is interesting and uh, detail of the hair, that's what I want to show. Well, let's make one layer on color, change, blend more to color. Then I'm gonna add her skin tone to be a little bit nice. Okay, use the uh, airbrushing group, soft airbrush. Just touch the shadow area shows more colors. Okay, and also I'm gonna emphasize some uh, dress. Now I'm gonna put some cracking. Wow, well, I wanna make this crack to be reddish. Now let me see her makeup. Touch and emphasize. Okay, on this layer, you see this. Okay, now smudged layer, and this is the base image. Let me see if I change this mode, it's not going to change. I'm going to move this base image over this uh, smudged layer, then change blend mode to look for some detail on her hair. Maybe add, add 60%, 70%. Now you see the detail on her hair. Just on hair has more texture on it. Okay, this is add 70. Maybe 50 to 70. That's fine too. Well, let's change. Let's see. Overlay lighter. Screen. That's gonna make more detail too, of course. Sometimes using screen for shadow detail on Adobe Photoshop too. So, well, I'm gonna use screen, then make a mask. Okay, make mask, invert mask. Now reveal this with, I think we have something lines. Inking to tile scene. Let's see. Does have some texture, looks like. Well, this experience is 
All right. Now leave this one here. Now, no. What else? Okay. Why don't I make color on ground? This cracked desert sand, desert ground. Okay. I'm gonna add another layer. Add layer, then bring this layer all the way down. Then change color. Then I'm gonna use that. Well, let's see some texture, some kind of um, desert ground, some kind of sand. This look like sand. Well, let me try. Now, want to see the texture, so change the blend mode normal. Otherwise, I don't see much, maybe. Well, and I uh, use that color to be a little bit sand, yellowish. Let's see the effect. Change. Linear burn, color burn. Well, color burns kind of interesting. I'm gonna make, just leave it normal blend mode to paint first. Then I change the blend mode to see the effect if how how much it's gonna affect. Not much area to paint anyways. Okay, let's see. Change color burn, linear burn, texture brush to paint, huh? Saturation. This is kind of interesting. Color. Kind of interesting, don't you think? When you make it light, lighter, then like Mm, something dirty look, but uh, when you go up to 100 max, then something interesting texture on a brush and also the color. Hmm, it does, it does interesting. Well, let's let me keep one. Okay, let's open it up. Now, I keep the one, this image. Now I'm gonna change this one to be I'll change this this is subtract this is exclusion well maybe soft to look here yeah I just want to keep exclusion kind of soft look huh hmm and difference this is not bad well hard mix Soft mix. Yeah, I kind of like difference, exclusion, sub subtract. Yeah, subtracted is nicer because these colors, um, shadow area is more darker blue. Yeah, just keep it that way. Then I'm gonna, well, turn down to 50%. Let me see. Max is flying and uh, this is difference, right? Subtract, difference. Let me see, subtract, then only this layer change. Let me see, hue saturation brightness. Well, goes to Christmas. This is kind of dirty, look. Yeah, blues, nice, huh? Yeah. Purple, no. Reddish, no. Ghost, so. Kind of dirty. No, just leave it. Go back. Yeah, this is nice. Hmm, happened to be kind of. I like this. Yeah. Okay, now just keep for this. Difference is fine too, so just keep this one. Then let's see. 
this color I changed everything already and this is a mask let me see change this this is screen maybe go max much lighten up light on, on her hair and this is much damage well I guess this is yeah this is it Oval is fine I think a lighter 30% is alright. Maybe if I play around is change color, add color, cyan, blue eyes, some lighten up. Touch bluer. Yeah, maybe that's it. Well, this is it for today and uh, I hope this movie is going to give you some kind of idea to make your own creative work. Well, I really appreciate for you guys' support and uh, you guys have a nice day. Well, see you next time. Bye now. Ciao.